Welcome back to Blackburn Arena for game two of our coverage on Baby Blue Memories. Love Spirit Lacrosse Tournament. Exhibition tournament getting underway. The Intermediate Hunters, so. They're gonna log in Intermediate Hunters. No single player on this roster has played a Junior B game before. There was one player that played Junior C last season, but no one else has ever played Junior B until today. And they lost their first game 11-2 to the Akwazaste Thunder. Here comes Marcus Daibo. Pushing it up. And Daibo decides to retreat. Back out to Gabriel. Logan Gabriel, he scored the Hunters only two goals in game one. And that's patted aside. Well, Milwaukee won the season series with Gloucester 3-1 last season. Both teams eliminated in the first round. The Griffins lost 3-0 to Orangeville. The Hunters lost 3-2 to Halton Hills. Griffins in the red with green, yellow, and black trim. And that's knocked away, stolen by Chaz Norton. Marcus Idols now in possession. Gabriel, three lefties out there for the Hunters. And that shot never did get through. Picked up by Gloucester. Back come the Griffins. Marcus Idols going to get called for a slash here. I'm not saying that call was obvious, but both referees made the same gesture at the same time for the same infraction. Penalty coming up to the Hunters. Yeah, but Jim Houston was rather robotic in his approach. He was exciting in the NHL games that he commented on. As the Gloucester Griffins have their first power play of the game, this Hunter's penalty kill brought to you by Find the Queen at Mohawk Super Bingo. There's a shot and a save made back in, though, on the Hunters. So the Griffins will maintain control. Gloucester in the red with white, yellow, and green trim. The Hunters in white with red and black, burgundy and black. Gloucester playing from right to left. Shot from 50, not on, and that will hit the ceiling and give the ball back to Gamawagi. 22 minute halves, basically, is what we're running here. 25 minute halves. But then, yeah, guess who Jacobs gets over center? George Jacobs. Threw it out, nobody home. And the Griffiths pick it up, and here's a break. Closer. Four. One nothing Griffiths. And these, as we mentioned, no hunter has ever played against junior B lacrosse players until today. Intermediate team coming in playing in a junior B tournament. And your first test was going up against the defending national runners up. And now you're playing against an, a team that went 11 and 9 last year. In and I would argue, based on the games last year, yeah, the Gunawagi Akwazuste rivalry is more fierce, but the Hunters and Griffins games last year were more intense and more scrappy. Shot clock at 15. Gabriel. Bounces one, save. Press 30 Hunters. Gabriel. Dash Saibo. Fires and scores! Well, you got to send in the younger guys to come in and get their licks and there's a player still playing midget this year dash Naibu getting the goal to tie this baby up at one that is a good shot by dash Naibu number seven in white 
And the ball is scooped up by the Griffins, or I thought it would be. And the Hunters have possession. Taz Norton. Swings it over to the far side. And now Daigo, in isolation, goes around his man. Love save made, and the Hunters are on it. Logan Gabriel behind the net. Spins off a check. Logan in front, and that pass is scooped up very low, but scooped up anyway. And the ball will get by Gabriel and go back in. Lucas Daigo on his net. Shot clock at 10. Hey, that far side shot clock's running again. Seven seconds to go. Gabriel swings it over. They got to get a shot off. They will save. As Dash Daigo was turned away in tight. And here comes Boston. <laughs> There's a pick. Gloucester looking to the middle, but they'll come back up high. Now on the far side, shot clock is at 10. Bible gets picked. And that ball stuck in front of the house, scooped up by the Hunters. Jacobs to Marcus Dybul in a semi-transition, and he missed the net. Shot clock yet to be reset. Well, it looks like they're gonna have to reset it now regardless. Kale Rice swings it out. Chaz Norton shot fake. Let you rip and that's blocked. They hit a wall in front of the Gloucester house. Marcus Diver shot off down to 12. He got yard sale. And a one-on-one. -on -one. Two one advantage Griffins. This game, of course, brought to you by Mohawk Super Bingo. They'd be the sponsor for every single Hunters Road game this season. Gabriel up top. There's a ripper that won't hit the net. That was Jackson Norton with the shot. Norton. And Gabriel's in the crease. There's a shot through traffic, it does not hit the net. And Ganawagi will retain possession here. Leading two to one are the Griffiths. Chaz Norton. Russell Dahoe Gabriel out there, as is Rohe Stacy. Pass over the head of Gabriel. Picked back up by Stacy. Shot clock is seven. Stacy shoots that stop. The rebound. They gave him the reset. Referee in the back of the net called for a reset. And the Hunters will get another opportunity here on this possession. Roy Hio Stacy, Russell Dahoe Gabriel back. Dash Daibo on the far side. Daibo around the screen. Daibo gave it up. Chaz Norman being chased. He's got it. Five seconds left. Dash bounces one. And Gabriel has to fire, and that won't hit the net. Shot clock violations. 
Oh, yeah, sorry. I just got Back comes Lawson. Good strip. Nearly taken away. And it is stolen by Marcus Daibo. Daibo in and out. Shoot, six, A. Fourteen thirty-five left to go. Gloucester two, Gonzaga one. Here, game two of this exhibition tournament. The Hunters sending their intermediate team, and there's a shot save made. Austin Lamaru, who's got his second goal of the game, has made it 3-1 to one Gloucester. Lamaru last year in 11 games played 40 points for the Griffins. Press 30, Gloucester. No one tomorrow at 8 o'clock, eh? Yes, here. Yeah. No. Uh, yes. That's going to roll right on. And the Hunters gather. Stolen McGregor. George Deacons. The top. Russell Dunhoe and Gabriel. Logan Gabriel, the cousins, working in unison here. Shot clock down to 10. Shot clock down to 5. Ball got knocked away and the Griffins are on it. <laughs> That's going to be... That would be a really good block by a tight end laying out a uh, cornerback or a safety in the middle of the field. Not really permitted though in the game of lacrosse. You have to be stationary somewhat on your picks. I think I'm using the term stationary loosely. Here's a break well soon. Four one Griffins with uh, 11.55 left to go. Pushing the tempo and he'll slow it up. And he had the stick trip. Lamaru. He's got two goals for the Griffins today. Screen shot, save made, and a rebound. Lucas Dival gives it to George Jacobs.
Under 10 left to go here in this first half. Gloucester on top, four to one. There's a shot fake and a drive. Hit a wall in front. Crease violation, or back in violation call on the Hunters who went lost the ball. There's on the Zard. I won't hit the net. The rebound bounces back near side. Marcus Dibo, one on one, has the ball. Marcus Iber lost it, and that'll be a push on the back. Giving the ball to Gloucester with 8.50 and counting left there. and the ball goes out of play and into the hunter's bench. Here come the hunters. Chaz Lorgan. George Jacobs. Gabriel. He shoots. Griffin's control shot clock down to 14. There's a drive, and Lucas Nibo finds the handle. Lazar lost the ball, it's stolen. Lamaru for the hat trick, and he scores. Austin Lamaru, it's 5 1 Gloucester. He's got his third of the game. Elliot Malcolm with the hattie. And he's got his third of the game, 5 1 advantage, Gloucester. And we've, that was just a shot clock going off. Okay. Chaz Lord, I'm oh, sorry, Marcus Dival. Drops it back. Penalty coming up to Gloucester. Slashing call. Here's Dash Idol. So find the queen power play. Gabriel, Daibo, George Jacobs. Ooh. That might have been a moving pick, but anyway, it's a good one. Yes. And uh, a slash coming up to George Jacobs. Extra attacker on for the Griffins. And I take that back. That's the only gentleman that's played Junior B for this Gunnawagi team today, George Jacobs, who played for Wallaceburg. And he's not going to be coming on the floor for 12 minutes. He just picked up a 10. He picked up a two and then a delay of game or on sports in like 10. So someone else is going to have to go in the, the penalty box for the Hunters. Uh, 
So Kale Rice is in the box, serving a penalty picked up by George Jacobs. He will sit for the rest of this half. Goal. And I believe the minor penalty that Kale Rice is serving is now over, and Jacobs is just going to be in the box for the rest of the half. He should be allowed out. There wasn't a double minor that was picked up, it was just a minor. That's the power play goal. And now George Jacobs is going to have to sit for the rest of the half. Unless it was just a... Okay. So it's five on four. Anyway, those two still on the power play. Here they come. And the ball trickles in the net. They score. That'll do it for the power play. 7 1 Losey. So Kale Rice has served the penalty. Now, what's the ruling that it was a minor, an unsportsmanlike, and then a 10, which I think might have been. That might have been the call. 2.59 left to go in the first half. Seven one gloves to lead. Picked up by the Griffins. Shaw so hit the outside of the post and the Griffins picked it up. It's loud. Ten seconds to go on the shot clock. There's a hard pick and a moving one more goal. Gabriel, shot, save, and he went through the crease. Let's give it up. and a slash is being called. And James Stacy will go to the Sinbin. As we get into the last 70 seconds of play here in this first half. Force the turnover. 
15 to go in the first half. Griffiths are going to have to get a shot off down to the last 10. Malcolm got the feed. He's got a hat trick, Elliot Malcolm. There's a shot, and they beat the buzzer. 8-1 Gloucester at half. Well, there we go. Game two, half two. Going to log in to Gloucester. The Griffins lead 7-1. to one. There's a minute 20 left in the penalty. We got a trippy call coming up. This is an over back on Marcus Seibel. It's an illegal cross check. Sorry. On uh, the Griffins. And that will do it for the power play. And then it'll be four on four now for the next minute running time. Gloucester leading it eight to one here on the Hunters, thanks to a goal from Dash Daibo. Here we go. Gabriel tried to flick it out in front. Scoot back up by the Hunters. Gabriel lost it, 12 seconds left. Three seconds left. Logan Gabriel. There's a shot. Save. Russ and Delaway. Gabriel scoops it up. Fresh 30 hundreds. Nibo. Good work by the Gabriel boys, Logan and Russell Dahoway. Russell Dahoway gets the loose ball. And then he gets it over to Logan, who finds Dash Daibo, and Dash has the second goal of the game. Logan Gabriel has a point on all four Hunters goals today. And that'll make it 8-2. Virginia Gesu Jacobs won the draw. Kale Rice back out to Marcus Daibo. Daibo trying to find the right pick. We'll get by one. Backhander, no. Sidebar violation against the Tore that play the first half for the Hunters. And Lucas Diver's in here and he's going to be tested with a breakaway. Lucas Diver makes the save. Quick stick. Norton swung it over. Shot by Logan Gabriel Block. Gabriel picks it up. Penalty coming up to Gloucester. And the Griffins will take a penalty. So the Hunters going back to work on the power play for the second time. Dash Daibo in the far corner. Gets a return feed. Daibo thinking about it. Now he'll drop back. 
Swung it back to the far side. And it's stolen by the Red And here it is, a breakaway opportunity. Off the iron. Over and back, yeah. It happens, it's a preseason. Back on the Hunters. There's a shot, scored! Martin. 8-3. And that is a power play goal. The Hunters have found the queen, just like you can at Mohawk Super Bingo, with find the queen jackpot going out each and every single Sunday. That makes it 8-3 with uh, 19 running time minutes left. But then you guess who Jacobs is on a roll right now in that face-off dock. Trying to get it out to Marcus Ivo, and he does. Ivo. Saw clock down to four, Kale Rice. And that shot is not hitting the net. The Griffins will scoop it up here. And we've got uh, too many men on the floor against the Griffins. Don't hold on the ball. Bible air mails this one up the center. Jazz Norton, Chad, quick pass. Flick it right on, and Norton turned away. Back comes Gloucester in transition. 18 minutes left to go here. Marcus Diver got us taken away. Great pass down low, crease violation. Stole McGregor brings it back. Russell Dowling Gabriel. There's a shot. Hit the light. And I think we're going to get matching minors. At least a penalty, anyway. Yeah, all right. Marcus Dival's going to the sim in for, I believe, in a, a slash. So Gloucester goes to work on the power play. Behind him, Ronan Daivo. 
And it's scooped up by the Hunters. Jacobs, what? He went behind his back like he would if you're driving in for a layup in the NBA. And it worked. <laughs> Stone! What are you doing? Over and back. One minute left to go in the power play for the Griffiths. Well, it happens. It's preseason, right? fourth of the game and that'll make it 9-3 it's a power play goal for the Griffins here with 14-14 uh, left to go Well, 
Coaster save. Noah Norton. Rosie Dahoe Gabriel. Logan Gabriel. And now on the near side. Gabriel. Goal! Hey, hey! A behind the back penalty! George Jacobs! But the backhander from an obscure angle finds its way in, and it's 10 4. Jacobs yeah. 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 wins the draw. He's had a, a very good time today, at least in this game, in terms of getting them draws. Rebound, loose to the house, scooped up by Gloucester. See. Last five ball. In flight. Lost his balance. Good hit. Good rugby scrum in front of us here, and it's scooped up by Kale Rice. Rice is turned away. Pass out in front, shot, turned away by Lucas Nagel. Up the floor, and that pass is intercepted.
Five seconds to shoot. for his second goal of the day. Jackson, of course, the second year player in Midget, uh, having a pretty good run up to this point. Today he's got his third point of the tournament. And Gloucester wins the draw. Peace violation. towards his teammate at the bench. And here's a breakaway Gloucester. Cool. Three twenty left to go here. And back come the Griffins onto the near side. Rush the way, Gabriel with the steal. Gabriel in front of the net. Jacob turns, fires, good save. And George uh, gets taken out into the net. Fresh 30 Hunters. There's a home run pass. Marcus Dybo back on the fence. Down to the final 65 seconds here. Save. Marcus Dybo gonna challenge his man and shoots over the net. Chaz Norton will scoop it up. We're in the last 80 seconds. So 120 left to go. George Jacobs. Shot clock inspires. Kale Rice turned away. Up by Daivo. Jackson.
Jackson Norton fires in that stop. Norton bidding for the hat trick. And that's it. Oh, Gloucester takes this one by a count of 12 to 5, and that does it for game two. Even though the Hunters lost these first two games, you gotta 